What do you do when you hear a dangerous storm is coming? Do you know how to keep your family and yourself safe? Every year, thousands of people around the world are affected by coastal inundation when water causes flooding of coastal areas. Usually, there are advance warnings, but sometimes coastal flooding can catch us by surprise and we may not know what to do. You may think that coastal inundation only happens if there is a hurricane or storm with strong winds and heavy rain. But even far away storms over the ocean and tsunamis can affect coastlines. Also, flooding from rivers can spill onto the coast. Any combination of these can lead to dangerous coastal floods. To stay safe, it's important to know what to expect and what signs to look for. When a storm closes in on a coastline, strong winds push water towards the shore, causing the sea level to rise. This is called storm surge. It can cause several meters of water to be pushed towards the shore and often many kilometers inland, quickly flooding low-lying areas, destroying property and putting lives in danger. Such inundation is more severe when the tide is high. Historically, flooding, especially coastal flooding and storm surge, are the leading causes of hurricane-related deaths. Torrential rain can cause river levels to rise quickly and overflow their banks. Such flooding may come with no warning and can be very dangerous, especially if there is a storm surge and high tide at the same time. Even places which aren't experiencing hurricanes can be at risk of storm surge and flooding. High waves caused by storms can travel long distances from the storm center and may affect faraway shores, especially for low-lying islands of the Caribbean. Powerful swells can break close to the shore or long reefs, pushing water onto land, catching many people off guard. Coastal inundation puts lives and livelihoods at risk. The damage to homes, roads, ports and other property can set back local economies, including the tourism sector. So how do we keep ourselves safe? If you live in an area that is at risk of coastal flooding, Watch for early warning signs, such as heavy rain, increasing onshore winds, or increasing swells. Know your evacuation route and where emergency shelters are located. Listen to local alerting systems for current emergency information and instructions. If you are told to evacuate, do so immediately. Move to higher ground. If you are trapped in a building by flooding, go to the highest level. Do not enter places where you may become trapped by rising water. Do not drive around barricades and stay off bridges. Fast moving water can wash bridges away without warning, undermine roads and sweep away cars. Do not walk, swim or drive through flood waters. Turn around, don't drown. Don't swim during times of coastal flooding. By staying informed, we can keep ourselves and our families safe. Blood waters kill. For more information, visit www.wmo.int. Share this video to help others stay safe.